Hello viewers, this is a tutorial on how to automate unfollow on Tumblr using Socinator. If there are users you no longer want to follow, then Socinator can help you out. Let's start with the Accounts Manager screen from where we can navigate to configure the accounts. To do that, right-click on your Tumblr account and hit Go to Tools. This will take you to the Account Configuration screen. You can also see the available activities which can be automated on Tumblr through Socinator. Let's click Unfollow. This is very useful as it makes it faster and easier to unfollow a number of users within a period of time while narrowing them down in the process. There are several configuration categories for unfollow activity. Let's start with Unfollow Source. So here you can choose to unfollow people followed by software. So these are the users followed using Socinator. You may also unfollow people followed outside software. So these are the people you followed yourself without using Socinator. Finally, we have custom users list. So for this one, we need a specific profile URL of the users you want to unfollow. Let's say this is the profile URL. So you may clear using the clear all button and it's gone. You may also click this button to import from CSV or text file. Select the right file, then click open. And when you're done, click Save. So this will target custom users and unfollow them. So for unfollow source, let's select people followed by software or Socinator. We also have source type so you can further narrow down by choosing people who do not follow back. So these are the people who are not following you back on Tumblr. You may also select people who are following you back. Let's select people who do not follow back. Then for source filter, this allows you to filter the time as to when the user should have been followed. So specify the number of days and hours over here. The next tool is job configuration. This allows us to choose the speed at which an account should unfollow users. We have already created a few activity speed configurations which you can use like slow with an average daily activities of 20, medium with 83, fast with 166 or super fast with 333. Super fast is not recommended for new or real accounts. If you want to define your own speed settings, click advanced settings. Delay between each operation is the number of seconds between each user is unfollowed. Delay between jobs is the number of minutes the software should pause after unfollowing the number of users you set in number of unfollow per job. Number of unfollow per job will allow you to specify the number of users to unfollow per job or per cycle. You may also specify the number of users to unfollow per hour, per day, and per week. Click this box to increase each day with a specific number until it reaches another custom number of max unfollows per day. You can also create a daily schedule under day of the week when to operate. This is very useful if you want to keep unfollowing users even when you're asleep or busy doing other things. If you don't want to operate on, let's say, Monday, click the trash bin button under Monday and it's gone. You can add multiple time frames in one day. Simply click the day you want to configure, Monday for example, provide the start and end time, let's say 12 a.m. to 1.59 a.m. and click add interval and it's added. Let's add another one on the same day. Let's say 2 a.m. to 11.59 p.m. Click Add Interval. So as you can see, we can have several schedules in one day. You may save these time settings by clicking Create Favorite. Let's call it Tumblr Unfollow. Click Save. We can then open it by clicking Select Favorite Time and choosing Tumblr Unfollow. The next tool is Other Configurations. This allows us to enable Auto Follow or Unfollow if we check this box. You can stop unfollow and start follow tool by choosing this option. So check the first one when reaching a specific number of followings and when follower of followings is greater than a specific number. The next option is to stop unfollow tool and these would be the configurations when reaching a specific number of followings or when follower of followings is greater than a specific number. The last tool will allow us to manage blacklist or whitelist users. Blacklisted users are the Tumblr accounts you do not want Socinator to interact with. Whitelisted users are the opposite. So if you don't want to unfollow whitelisted users, click this box to skip them. 
This can either be a private whitelist which belongs to a specific Tumblr account or a group whitelist which is shared between all the accounts you add. You also have the option to add to blacklist after unfollowing the users. So this can also be either a private blacklist or a group blacklist. When you're satisfied with these configurations and are ready to start unfollowing users on Tumblr, let's scroll up and click Save. Success. After saving, let's click the status button to make it active. Now that it's active, let me show you another option in automating unfollow on Tumblr using Socinator. This one allows us to create campaigns, which is perfect for multiple accounts. To start, let's go to the upper right corner of the app and click the social drop down button and select Tumblr. This will bring us to the accounts tab. Let's switch to the grow followers tab and select unfollower on the left side of the app. Here we can name our campaign, let's call it Tumblr Unfollow. For unfollow source, let's check the first one, people followed by software or Socinator. For source type, let's filter those who do not follow back. For source filter, it's up to you. For job configuration, let's select slow. For other configurations, it's up to you. Then let's skip whitelisted users, private whitelist, and let's add to blacklist once unfollowed. So let's add them to a private blacklist. When you're ready, let's click the blue button, select account or accounts. In this part, you can select multiple Tumblr accounts. Since we only have one, let's go with that by checking the box, then click save. After saving, let's click the red button, create campaign. If you want to proceed, click your account and the save button. This will automatically bring us to the campaigns tab where you can see that you have successfully created our Tumblr unfollow campaign. Click the status button to pause the campaign and the action button over here will allow us to edit, duplicate, or delete the campaign. And that's it for this tutorial. I hope you learned a lot and thank you so much for watching.